welcome back to my youtube channel so in today's video i will be showing you guys how i created this makeup look i will be testing out the catrice uh, caviar gauche i'm not sure how you pronounce it but this really pretty uh, eyeshadow palette i will be testing out and also this new bronzer from essence so that's what i will be doing in this video first of all if you are new here on my channel i'm a dutch girl and i'm living in Maris, turkey and i make a lot of beauty related videos lifestyle vlogs if you like that make sure you subscribe and now let's get started with the video so i'm going to start off with my bb cream and i'm going to use the olas total effect seven in one bb cream and this is a moisturizer plus foundation with SPF 15 and I really like this for during the day because there's already a SPF 15 in it so you don't need to apply any sunscreen if you watched my other videos then you know uh, I like this baby cream but the coverage is really minimal so it has a really light coverage and this is in the lightest shade and as you can see I'm really pale at the moment and it's a bit too dark um, so yeah then you know that if you're pale like me but the weather is getting a lot better already here and um, yes I'm so excited to go swim again and lay in the sun and yeah the summers here in Turkey are amazing so yeah, as you can see a very minimal coverage so that's why I'm going in with a concealer and this is in the same shade as my skin and this is the Maybelline Fit Me in the color 10 and I'm going to use this in the places where I want a little bit more coverage so my skin has gotten a lot better um, I don't have any acne anymore but the only thing I still have is these scars from the acne so that's why I want to cover it up a bit more and I also applied a little bit on my eyelid uh, for the base for the eyeshadow I also have a um, eyeshadow primer but I think a concealer works fine so you don't need to spend that money I think then I'm going in with a other concealer and this is the revolution uh, conceal and define concealer and this is in the color C1 and this concealer I use to brighten up my face and I love this the coverage is amazing I used the Maybelline uh, anti-age erase concealer before and um, they're pretty similar and yeah, I like them both so yeah, I'm going in with this one and you don't need to apply too much because the coverage is really great so I just apply this where I want my face to be a bit more bright and then I blend it in with the same brush and as you can see just a few dots is enough and I love concealer, it makes such a big difference in your face. And then when I finished all of my cream products, I'm going to powder it all off with the Rimmel Stay Matte Powder in the color Silky Beige. And I hit the pan, so let's see how long it will last. So then one of my favorite products to use is a bronzer. And uh, this is a new bronzer that I haven't tried yet. And I got this from my sister. If you saw my Netherlands haul, I will link it somewhere up here. She got me a bunch of makeup products. And this is the Essence Luminous Matte Bronzing Powder for lighter skin. And this is in the color 01 Sunshine. And I really like like a glittery bronzer, but this looks quite matte. Um, yeah, let's see. Okay, so I think the color is yeah great for light skin. Like I said, I like to use like a shimmery bronzer. But if it's matte, I also don't mind it because then I can go in with like a shimmer break or something to make it a bit more sparkly. But yeah, I do really like the color. It's perfect for uh, now. It's a really nice bronzer. So then I'm going in with a blush from Golden Rose. And this is the Terracotta Blush On in the color 7. And it's a really pretty pink shade. And I love the shimmer in this blush. And then I'm going to apply my highlighter from MAC. And this is the MAC uh, Mineralized Skin Finish in the color Light Scapade. And then before I start to apply my eyeshadow, I want to do my brows first. And I'm using the Essence uh, Pencil, eyebrow pencil in the color Blonde. And I almost can't see it anymore. So like I said, I'm going to test out this Catrice uh, Caviar Gauche. I'm not 
really sure how you pronounce it, Gaucher, I guess. And this is a limited edition pressed pigment palette in the color C1 Crystal Collection. And I have to say, this is the most beautiful drugstore eyeshadow palette packaging that I've ever seen. It just looks so luxurious. I love all the little stones and the golden details. I think it's just amazing, such a gorgeous packaging. And then when you open the palette, you have a huge mirror right here. You have two really bright uh, glittery shades, a silver and a pink one. Then you have a few mattes and also a few colors with a bit of shimmer in it. So I think the colors are amazing. I'm so excited to try this out. And there's still plastic on it. I love to get this off. <laughs> It's so nice. Wow, look at that. So I'm going in with this shade right here. And let's see how the pigmentation is. Okay. It's a really nice crease shade. Nice brown and pigmented. And then I'm going in with this shade right here. And I'm going to apply this also in my crease. Oh, wow. Yeah, they are really nice and pigmented. And then I'm also going to apply this shade right here in my crease. This is a nice dark brown, but it also has a little bit of purple in it. And obviously I want to test out the glittery shade. So I'm going to try out this one right here, the pink, uh, the pink tone. And I think I'm going in with my finger because it's a lot easier. Oh my, that's super glittery. Oh wow, it looks a lot like a pigment that I have from MAC. You get it in like a small little uh, bottle. So I'm going in with my Fix Plus because I feel it works a little bit better that way. With Fix Plus you make it a bit more like sticky. Perfect for like a party or like a festival look as well. So I really love the glitter. The only thing I should have done is to put a color underneath it um, but yeah, I'm going in now with another shade with this one right here and I'm going to apply it a little bit around the uh, glitter and I'm also going to apply a little bit of the brown color underneath my eye and then the last thing I'm going to do is put the cream color in the middle right here I'm going to apply that underneath my eye and in my inner corner. And this is really nice and pigmented. And the last step is some lip gloss and I'm going in with my favorite, the NYX Better Gloss in the color Eclair. I think the glitter shade is so pretty and the other colors as well. I think they are really pigmented and they blend easy and I just really love these shades all together. The only thing like I said already that I should have done is to put like a pink um, color underneath it. So for the next time I will do that for sure. And I think the glitter is great for if you have like a party or a, a festival or something like that. So yeah, I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to give it a huge thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. I upload twice a week, every Wednesday and Saturday. And of course, you can also follow me on Instagram. And I hope to see you guys very soon in one of my other videos. Bye.